Hey Ansible heroes, Jack Wallen here to help you get things done. Today, we're going to install the web-based Ansible AWX GUI Manager on Scent OS 8. The first thing to take care of is the installing of the dependencies. Log into your Scent OS 8 server, open a terminal window, and issue the following commands. sudo dnf install epel-release-y sudo dnf install git gcc gcc-c++ ansible node.js get text device-mapper-persistent-data lvm2 bzip2 python3-pip-y we now need to install both Docker and Docker Compose. The first thing to do is add the necessary repository with the command sudo dnf config manager dash dash add dash repo equals https colon slash slash download dot docker dot com slash linux slash centos slash docker dash ce dot repo. Once the repository is added, install the latest version of Docker with the command sudo dnf install docker dash ce dash 3 colon 18 dot 09 dot 1 dash 3 dot el 7 dash y start and enable the docker engine with the commands sudo system control start docker sudo system control enable docker add your user to the docker group with the command sudo user mod dash a capital g docker dollar sign capital user log out and log back in. Install Docker Compose via pip3 with the command sudo pip3 install docker-compose. Finally, set Python to use Python 3 with the command alternatives dash dash set python slash user slash bin slash python3. Now we can finally install AWX. Clone the latest release with the command git clone https colon slash slash github.com slash ansible slash awx.git. Next, generate a secret encryption key with the command OpenSSL RAND dash base 64 30. Copy the key that is generated to your clipboard. Change into the newly downloaded AWX directory with the command cd awx slash installer. Open the AWX inventory file with the command nano inventory. In that file, you'll need to, at a minimum, edit the following configuration options. First, locate the line secret underscore key equals. In that line, paste the secret key you generated earlier. Next, look for the line admin underscore password equals password. Change the password to a strong, unique password. Finally, look for the line that starts with pound awx underscore alternate underscore dns underscore servers equals. Change that line to AWX underscore alternate underscore DNS underscore servers equals double quote 8.8.8.8 comma 8.8.4.4 .4 double quote. Save and close the file. Create a directory for Postgres with the command sudo mkdir slash var slash lib slash pg docker. Install AWX with the command sudo ansible dash playbook dash i inventory install dot yml before we can access the awx site we need to disable se linux issue the command nano slash etsy slash sysconfig slash se linux change the line se linux equals enforcing to se linux equals disabled save and close the file restart your system so the changes will take place the last step is to modify the firewall this is done with the following commands. sudo firewall-cmd-zone equals public dash dash add dash masquerade dash dash permanent sudo firewall-cmd dash dash permanent dash dash add dash service equals http sudo firewall-command dash dash permanent dash dash add dash service equals HTTPS sudo firewall dash cmd dash dash reload. Finally, open a web browser and point it to http colon slash slash server IP, where server IP is the IP address of your hosting server. 
you'll be greeted by the AWX login screen, where you'll use the admin username and the password you set in the admin underscore configuration. Once you authenticate, you'll find yourself in the AWX dashboard, where you can begin working with Ansible through this user-friendly web-based GUI. Hey, everybody. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our Tech Republic YouTube channel. And be sure to check out more how-to videos at How to Make Tech Work.